Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. By now, hopefully most of you know that uh, I've got Windows Vista running on this particular machine at this present time, but at some point in the past, about six months ago, I decided to drop Windows Vista to go back to Windows XP, only to then a couple days later go back to Windows Vista because XP sucked more than I remember it sucking, specifically even on this machine. Uh, this happens to be Windows Vista Ultimate Edition, which means that uh, I have access to these things called extras. Unfortunately, Microsoft has released little to no extras, and the ones they have released, well, the word sucked um, would be putting it lightly. Uh, it's been wholly unimpressive, uh, and I think Microsoft has completely dropped the ball and have made has made Vista Ultimate an absolute joke. Uh, and hey, just just don't don't take my word for it. Ask other people uh, who may or may not be happy or unhappy with Windows Vista Ultimate and their purchase of that operating system. One of our community chat members has been begging me to answer this question. Yo, Dada! Well, I think he's here right now. Says, okay, I got a question for Chris Perillo, and he was asking this in the chat room earlier, and I copied it down. Either I did or Lynn did. What are your takes on Windows Vista's dream scene, and have you used it? Also, what is your overall take on it for our next video? And thank you, Yo Data. That was a pretty good question. I have a Windows Vista Ultimate on this machine. Unfortunately, my screen resolution is so large that uh, dream scene won't work on it. So Dream Scene is a software that integrates with Windows Vista, specifically Windows Vista Ultimate. Allegedly, it'll only work on that version of Windows. And instead of using a static background, it will actually play a video as the background. And they've recorded these really uh, nice, smooth videos to be playing in the background uh, while you're working and having video set as your desktop. And I had tried them, and in each time on, on other uh, machines that were running Vista Ultimate, uh, each time I'd use it for about five minutes or ten minutes, I'd turn it off. <laughs> Honestly, I mean, I, I, I'm doing enough here. I don't need to be distracted here. Uh, and certainly, I don't need any more resources taken away from here. And that's what Windows Dream Scene does. It's only in beta at this point, and even that beta is very, very rough. There have been blog posts from a handful of insiders who have said, yeah, it's just, it's, it's really not looking great. But then again, Microsoft doesn't exactly have fully optimized code, uh, first version out, and we haven't even hit a first version for Windows Vista Dream Scene. So if you have the opportunity to play videos as your desktop background and you want it, yeah, okay. Uh, my recommendation, don't spend the extra money for it because, quite honestly, it's not worth anything. In fact, they should be paying you to run something like that since it takes away so much and offers so little in return. Uh, maybe the, they'll make the desktop experience much more rich at some point, uh, than, richer than it actually is, and not mess it up like they tried to do with Active Desktop, which was Microsoft's first messing around on the desktop where they would allow you to uh, embed web pages directly on your desktop, but it was such a resource hog that it was, no doubt about it, in their top 10 worst applications ever uh, that they ever unleashed onto the world, and unfortunately, some people still fall victim to Windows Active Desktop to this very day. So hopefully, uh, you know, I'm accurate in saying that Windows Dream Scene is uh, just an absolute waste. Uh, even as a toy, it's marginally interesting. I don't know, what does everybody else think? Do you use Dream Scene all the time or something like it? Do you happen to enjoy it longer than 10 minutes? Uh, have you found a great impact in terms of performance on the, the rest of your system? Does it get sluggish when you're running it? Uh, or does it work just fine and you have no problem running all the extras you can possibly throw at Windows? Uh, I, everybody's got a different opinion. And as you can see right now, I'm not even running any kind of wallpaper at all because I was having issues with NVIDIA on Windows Vista and they still can't get their act together. I don't know about NVIDIA as a, as a company anymore. I mean, I'm sure they're doing okay, but th their drivers on Windows Vista are laughable. I mean, just like sad, laughable um, at this point. So anyway, I don't know. What do you guys think? Dream scene? Yay? Nay? A? Let us know. Leave a comment, follow-up, response, whatnot. Uh, are you disappointed? I don't know. Maybe you are. Maybe you like them. Or swing by the chat room. Uh, we promise not to throw any wacky video backgrounds inside of our live chat 
at least the one that we control. I mean, you can do that if you want to. I'm not, not, not like I'm encouraging that behavior at all. But anyway, if you want to know where to find us, we're at live.perillo.com. Giggity.